Drew, we're almost midway through Sun and Fun. It's been a great week. But one of the things that was interesting is that the announcements from Piper just kept on coming and coming and coming. Do you guys ever take a break? Well, uh, no, we're in the business of uh, selling trainers. And uh, uh, we've been doing trainers uh, since uh, over 85 years at Piper. So it's part of our core business, and uh, we're going to keep at it. Well, tell me first, this 115 aircraft sale with options and so forth, how did that come about? We've been working with Blue Line for quite a while, and Blue Line wanted to have another partner. Uh, they were opening up uh, another school here in Florida, and it was a great opportunity to talk to them and be able to supply their single and twin engine uh, flight training needs with the Piper products. Well, it's an outstanding deal, to say the least. It had to be real exciting about the time that got signed. It's nice to have a long-term five-year agreement with a flight school that's, that's going to have some deliveries throughout the period that actually gives you a pipeline of airplanes so that you can have a good, steady, strong backlog. Both the Archer series turned into the 100i as well as the Seminole are continuing to maintain tremendous strength in a market that's been kind of weird, to say the least, between who's working with so-called you know, the new breed of airplanes and so forth, or for that matter, even some of the overgrown LSAs. How do you remain relevant in an aircraft that has a lineage going back so far? Doesn't that work against you at all? No, it really doesn't. When you look at the Piper product, you know, the best thing we can do is give a customer all the references from all the flight schools that have bought Piper products. And the one thing that they'll find out is that the Piper product is very durable, it's rugged, and we've got awesome support compared to some of the others out there. So uh, when you're in the business of, of training students, you've got to have airplanes that are reliable, that can fly hundreds of hours a month, and keep on going. And with a Piper, they keep on going. Let's go back to some of the M-Series announcements. You folks have been tweaking that airplane pretty good, whether you're in it or outside of it. Yes, and uh, you know we just announced here at the show uh, Plain Sync with Garmin. We're the first OEM to have this in, in the uh, first part of this year, where really you can wake up your airplane. There's a lot of connectivity and a remote access that you can now do with your plane, even downloading databases. There's so many cool features now with Plain Sync that uh, we're excited to be offering that. M600 SLS airplanes that the customers are taking today will have that feature here shortly. It's it's already uh, an option that's that's standard in the airplane. Drew, we, we really appreciate you spending some time with Aero News and Airborne, and we look forward down the line to, I think I'm scheduled at some point out here to come out and play with the 600, and I can't wait. Great. Well, we look forward to having you, Jim, and, and of course, you're pretty close to Vero Beach, and uh, look forward to having you there to fly the 600 SLS. Sounds like a plan. Thank you, sir. Thank you.